Hey everyone and welcome back. Hey everyone and welcome back to part 3 of our Norse Lands playthrough. Uh, pretty much our only goal for this time is to try and figure out what that statue or if we can get Mjolnir from it. Um, I'm gonna assume that we, we should be making it look like these symbols which I will write down because that would be useful. We can assume that that middle one is sort of like a, a one um, with the little head coming off the, the end of it. So we'll have to go with that assumption for the time being. And if that doesn't work, then that's fine. We'll, we'll keep playing around. got a feeling it started with pretty much the right orientation and then things got uh, worse as I messed around with them. So maybe the... Oh, God damn it. Not quite. Is they, are those the three options? Oh, fiddlesticks. Hopefully we should be able to defend ourselves, to be honest. Oh. If we had some fire. Ah, it's not quite going to be all of them. lost the dog. It's fine. We uh, we can go back and have a look. Yes, yes, you're out of energy. Okay, so we've sort of got... It's like an exclamation mark. I feel like that's wrong. Okay, no, it is the eye. So those, those are correct. So I think that will sort of... Um, play with the theory that we've got, so that should be the right way around for that. That should be the right way around. Then we want uh, the one with the little cross through, but the cross going the other way. Okay, that should be it, but we now just need the coins to go back and activate it. So that's pretty interesting. Those rocks uh, show what you do need to have, and then you just need to go and, and arrange the, the stones like that. I think they did start pretty close to that orientation. Um, so it's sort of there to tease you and be like, hey, if you mess around with these, then you've got to put in even more effort, which inevitably we had to do. Oh, didn't mean to set everyone on fire, my bad. Now we should try and clear some more trees for our hunters whilst we're here, give them a bit more ground so we can get a few more coins. But they do have quite a big bit of territory now to be fair. Um, so actually it should be fine. Okay, so we just need to give some jobs to them. I'm not sure if those rocks will be a different orientation every time, um, or if that rock will have different writing on it. But that's just, that seems to be the way that that mystery gets solved. I don't know why I just spent all that money that I want to use on getting Mjolnir, but you know, maybe we should still have enough. Guys, got anything for us? Very nice. Let's go see what we've got. Personally, I'm liking this this mount. 
It's got a decent amount of stamina and also has the ability to set things on fire. So, you know, seems pretty good. Yeah, and there we have it, as expected. We now have... So now, um, much like the Deadlands DLC or, or campaign, it's the same button to activate that ability. Not sure what sort of cooldown length it has, but we will see. I can't use it again immediately, so that's something. That seemed to be the activation there, so that's quite a short cooldown. And we're going to get to see that in action tonight. Still a little bit disappointed in the banker not wanting to show up. We fully upgraded here. I think those are the correct level walls. Um, but this won't cause an issue. I'm just gonna. Can I pay for the merchant? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Let's let's see. How Thor does things. Um, pretty crazily. That's going to be quite handy. Okay, yeah, there was no uh, upgrade to the walls, and I mean, you can already see I can use Mjolnir again. And I don't know if you saw that, but that just completely murdered those squirrels, or chickens, pheasants, whatever one it was. Um, savage. But Thor's got to eat. Okay, so next thing to do. Uh, we're pretty much ready to move on. Now that we will just want to check the map and see if I've forgotten about anything. We haven't got the hermit. But, um, oh, I feel like we haven't got all of the chests on this island yet, actually. There should be a gem chest over on this side of the island. So we'll just uh, pay a few coins here so we've got space for them. Because I would quite like to grab this hermit as well. Because if it's the Ballista one, then there has been a buff to that Hermit and to the Ballista Towers, as far as the patch notes have said. So it'll be interesting to see what that actually looks like. Okay, there wasn't another one on this side. Have we, have we definitely missed them? Or did we spend all of them? We spent three on the Builder Statue, or what I assume is the Builder Statue. Um, and we spent about three on the other one, on the, the Mount, I mean. So there should be another chest about, unless they've changed how many chests there are. Just get you guys building as much as possible. I'll explore the right hand side of the island again in the morning. Very nice. I think we'll go for a wall upgrade just because we've got Mjolnir's hammer and a flaming horse to defend with if we need to. So if we do get some more gems, then we'll swing back 
on to the first island. Um, I think we'll do that regardless. I'll have to double check how much the archery statue usually costs, but I don't think it's too many. in time. Doesn't seem too keen on self-preservation. Alright, let's have a little uh, over-the-top use of my hammer. Ugh, didn't mean to do that. Let's, um, let's go and spend loads of coins on the boat, because we can. the right hand side of the island again because we're forgetful and lose track of what we've seen and what we haven't. Got a lot of people here that haven't got a job. These guys are going to have a few coins because it will be handy to have some in the bank. And when I say bank, I mean my pockets because the bank doesn't seem to exist. So even if there's not another gem chest, we won't be able to afford that hermit. I, f I can't remember if we went all the way out on this side. We might have reached this next portal and then decided not to go further. Nope, that, that's it. Okay, so there's not any more gem chests on this island, which is interesting. So I feel like there were only two. So unfortunately we're not going to be able to test out that hermit, but we will, uh, we, I will just have a look and the, uh, where is it, not hermits that I'm looking for, I mean I've, I've made videos on this stuff, I should ha know how much the, um, I should know how much the statues cost, but it slips your mind when you haven't played for a bit. Three gems. So we won't have enough if we go back. So it will be time to push on to the fourth island. Which is interesting. We might as well sort of do that this part. where We can head out there because we've got our um, walls fully upgraded now. And we'll see what the fourth island holds for us. Maybe there's even more fun things to spend our money on. We're at day... Huh, just coming up on day 20. So we've still got about... I want to say about 16 until winter. But I can't, I can't remember. I can't remember if winter starts around 36 or maybe a little bit later. Oh no, one of our guys got got. One of our precious builders will um, we'll get a new one. Oh, we've still got a long way to go with the boat anyway.
whilst I'm sort of sorting out in the background getting um, getting more coins and whatnot I'm just gonna have a double check through my footage of the first part and see if I can see how much the gem cost of the statue is on there because who knows maybe it's a little bit different from what I remember hammer must be really heavy. I mean, maybe because it's magical and whatnot, it's really light, but it doesn't look like it. Still not enough coins. Yes, okay, so it does cost three gems to use the, um, oh, we've got incoming. I should protect my builders, to be honest. Oh, that boat's pretty much done. ability has a slightly longer cooldown than I think it does. But as you can see, you can still pretty easily take out a wave by yourself. I think we'll just uh, head on to the fourth island, get a rough idea of what's about. I do feel like I should have a, a, another quick scout of this side in case I've missed a gem chest, but I don't know how I could. I feel like they're pretty obvious. generally marked by these bits in the background as well. There's nothing there unless there's one right up next to the portal, which there is not. It's interesting that there's no like skull over the top of that. It means it will look a little bit different when it explodes, I guess, or, or maybe the inside of them is very different. the ship and get ready to go. It should bring us some coins as they come along. Do 
Doesn't seem, unless maybe it's an upgrade or something, doesn't seem like you can, uh, didn't mean to do that, sorry mate. Yeah, even, he doesn't even seem to pick up coins. Maybe he already is full, to be fair, he's been around for quite a while, but let's get a quick set of coins off of him. Give these guys like an extra builder or something. Get some coins off of this right and then we can head to the boat and move on. Seems like enough coins to keep us going. Oh and for the sake of it we'll pay the merchant. Okay, time to see what wonders the Fourth Island has. Another sort of horse, scythe statue, and hermit that could be the stable. They tend to like fancy hats. And then another relic of sorts, which we won't know how to um, get. So it looks like it's this way to the camp. to uh, purchase here. Okay, that we're gonna have to find another indicator of uh, what it actually is. Good to see that there's two very close camps on the right hand side though. That will be helpful for building up defenses. Another gem chest, but I think I'll... Oh, let's see. I think that's the stable hermit. So we'll just grab them, because there are some cool mounts that we might want to use a bit further on. A lot of gems, we're going to want to get our town centre upgraded. I think that needs to happen before you can uh, deposit them in the gem chest next to where the boat gets built. Should have rested there. Okay, let's have a little look. We've got, like, okay. Four of the same symbols on those and, like, a cross on that one's head. So... Hopefully we'll find some other rock around somewhere that will give us some indication of what that means. Who knows, to be honest, right now. These gems are a bit of a menace. Need to get a few more archers, because, well, we need the defense. And the income. Dog is making quite a fuss. Don't quite have enough for that. Hopefully one of these fellas will have done a bit of shooting. Not much. Oh, that looked like big structure on the left there. Or something. We um, 
Let's see. Some sort of horse man. Oh, like a wolf. I think I've seen things a bit looking like a wolf. I don't think we'll bother with the scythe statue, which means we should have... Um, that's another another horse of sorts. Um, yeah, I don't think we'll bother with the scythe statue, which means we've got more uh, more gems at our disposal. Okay, we do need to clear some space though. So our archers have room to hunt in. Yes, yes, our dog seems to be a little bit broken. Okay, cool, that should give them a bit of room to hunt in. And we'll uh, just hopefully have enough coins for this. Just about. And get a few coins off of these guys. Ooh, sorry everyone. That coin chest is a nice sight. Okay, so here comes here comes our clue for this, maybe. Unless this is um, oh, that's going to be the scythe statue. Okay, ignore that then. Did have a nice picture, I presume, of Idrisil, the world tree on it. Right, so there is no hint for that um, for that whatever it is, set of scales and whatnot on the right hand side of this island. The other interesting thing is that was it for gem chests, only two on this island, so that definitely seems as though they've reduced the amount that there are, unless I'm unless I'm remembering incorrectly. I think two is probably actually right and I'm just being a bit of an idiot. Um, I'm thinking probably three chests overall. So that's fine, um, just need to be more picky with our choices and we've got six now so we can go back to the um, to the first island after this and pick up what we missed out on interestingly enough I don't know if I've seen um, the stone technology or iron technology, whatever the equivalent would be on this one. So we'll have to keep an eye out for that. Um, but for this time we'll, we'll just finish off this night attack and then we'll call it there with our shiny new hammer and our lovely horse. Which I gotta say, there's gonna have to be some pretty powerful alternatives to make me want to use those instead because although the cat chariot was cool. It's not quite Mjolnir and flaming horse. side dealt with. Another one should be fine. They did break through, but we'll well we can just fix that up with one. Um so we survived the night attack and that is everything for this time. If you're looking for more tips and guides, then check out some of my other tutorials. But until then, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.